The darkness of the night surrounds me. The forest is slightly lit by the full moon. All of the treetops do not let the light pass much. There is a thick fog in the forest, and it does not let me move forward without hesitating on whether the path I follow is correct. The forest is too quiet. No animal noise is heard. I don't know how I ended up here. I can hardly remember who I am. I think I don't know. My head hurts every time I try to remember some clue of what has happened before entering the forest. I suddenly realize that I can't smell, and I can't see clearly, and it's not because of the light. I touch my face, everything is smooth. My eyes are missing, my mouth is too. And my nose. What happened to me, I tried to scream, but I can't do it. My hands are elongated and sharp. It is the first time I observe my body. Very thin to narrow, and I wear a suit. Suddenly I heard a few steps in the forest. An impulse takes over to try discovering them, provokes them. I advance through the thicket, hiding in the intense fog of that night. I see a warm light away among the trees. I turn to it and discover that it is a bonfire. There are people sitting around, all of silent except one that seems to tell a story. I watch them slowly. I want to ask for help. At the same time, a feeling of revenge and killing wake up in me. I want blood. I want their lives. The confusion also takes over me. Why do I want that? I do not know. Some tentacles come out of my back. They are long and sharp. They seem to have a life of their own, and they want to cross the hikers. The girl in the story is silent. She has seen me. At that moment, the wind extinguishes the fire. Before the girl could scream, my tentacles go to her, catching her. Nobody realized that I was there. And whatever I did to the girl, you don't want to know. The only thing I can tell you is that those guys didn't show up in the woods anymore. I still don't know what I am. I have seen posters in the part of the forest closest to the city. Who wanted an elongated being with the appearance of a woman hiding in the trees? They call her Slender Woman, and she's a tribute attendant so far. Is that me? Why can't I remember who I am? Why do I feel an incessant need to kill those who enter my forest? Is there another being similar to me? This is the end of the drama Life of Slender Woman. We would love if you commented with a short, scary story to be able to make a video with them. Until the next video.